instantly. Like, like right there. Right there, I died. And I did it again, so I'm skipping ahead. Now, if you fall off the bottom of the screen in Andy's room, you don't die. You, you bounce back upwards and lose a hit point. Talk about fake difficulty. Oh, and Yo-Yo's dangling from the ceiling in perpetual motion. This kid's a real scientist, too. Let's see here. Oh yeah, and don't try and get that extra life. It's impossible without losing a life first. Oh my goodness, this is annoying. Skipping ahead. Oh, and this is the this is probably the worst part ever. You see how I got past without nothing happening and then I died at the yo-yo? Now I thought this was avoidable, but I guess not. As you know, it happens in the movie that Sid uses the magnifier with the sun and stuff to light a fire on Woody's head. And it's really annoying to control him like this. Fortunately, the bowl of cereal was like five inches away. But guess what? It happens again. And there's no window to put sunlight in the room from here. Ugh, unnecessary level gimmick. To the extreme. Oh, there's the window. I can't even jump to get the stars. This is annoying. I might as well just bum rush it. But no, I gotta inch my way forward to be careful because, you know, you're while you're doing this, you run faster than Sonic the Hedgehog and can't really see what's what's coming at you until you've got already gotten hit by it. Fortunately, that's the end of the level. Ugh. The worst is yet to come, though, because now there are ca Coke cans falling from the sky. Or somebody's throwing Coke cans at me, I don't know. More spiders, more live dynamite. What is with this kid? He must be a... He must be a... A New Age retro terrorist. Well, he could grow up to be one. Because, you know, he's buying bottle rockets and blowing stuff up. Heck, he could be... He could really be Jeff from Earthbound or Lloyd in disguise. Hmm. Oh, and look at this. You see, there's a checkpoint down here. But you, you wouldn't see that if you just went to the, to the right. Um, for no reason. And I really like the music. The, the music that is supposedly coming from the rate from the boom boxes. Yeah, there's like 10 boom boxes in the, in this part of the little game. Oh, and this is really an this is even more annoying. Take that. Using Take that. Buzz's Take karate that. chop action. Take that. What? Ugh, I died. More of Tim Allen's annoying voice. Watch out. Watch out. Yep. Watch out. Oh, I can easily block that bug thing, but the legs, no. All this while, um, Stalin and Hitler's spawn is coming up from behind you. <laughs> I honestly... And no, I don't think Hitler and Stalin spawned that baby doll on a spider's head. <laughs> or maybe I do. But in any case, we go on to the worst part of this game. This is without a doubt the hardest level. I lost all my lives and had to use a continue. More Coke cans falling at you, and and a bottle rocket comes up from behind and kills me. So yes, so yes, this is a real James Bond like moment, I guess you would call it James Bond moment. There are explosions everywhere, and you're and Supposedly, Woody is keeping calm while this is happening, and the dog comes up from behind you, thus shrinking the screen by 50%. Now you really can't see what what's coming at you until you've already been hit by it. This is this is why I don't like Sonic the Hedgehog, but this is, but in this game it's to an extreme. And look at all the bombs coming at you. Where all, where's all this coming from? And why are there like 50 vacuums and 20 kitchen sinks in the room? And I died again. 
I'm I'm cutting ahead because showing all those deaths is really unnecessary when you only need it once or twice. And yeah, you know, just just look at this. This is the third to last level, so fortunately we're almost out of Toy Story hell. And it really doesn't matter how many hit points I lose, because I didn't get hit at all on the last level. But the good news is I, I hit the checkpoint and all. Ugh. Good lord. Oh, that was cheap. Those bombs are so annoying. Anyways, after this is the second to last level. Unless you're playing the Genesis version. I don't know much of... Well, actually, I saw videos of the Genesis version. If you're playing the Genesis version, you have to go through an annoyingly pointless Toy Story Mario Kart kind of level where you just collect power-ups until you get to the end. That sounds pointless, doesn't it? But fortunately, we're on the Super Nintendo version. We get to skip that and do another RC car level. Annoying controls as usual, but what's worse, you know those power cells that um, fuel your fuel? You have no clue where they are until you've been through it at least once before. And you're supposed to be keeping up with a red car, but the red car always seems to be ahead of you no matter how fast you go. Oh, and I can't go under those um, barrier things. Apparently, apparently, they're made of ice, too, just like everything else in this game. And I'd better find... <sighs> I died. What a surprise. And I've skipped ahead to a point to a point where I only have one chance at this left. I have another continue. Well, actually, I think I got the continue after this level. So yeah, the level's finished. Yeah, there's my extra continue. And I got an, and I got another hit point back. Here it comes. I just lit a Before rocket. Rockets explode. Off. Yeah, I had to pull that quote out. Uh, they oh, omitted yeah. that quote Here in this comes. part, which, you know, th the I just lit a rocket rockets explode quote was amusing oh, yeah. to me. Why'd they omit it? Anyways, this is where the game, to me, shows a little mercy, but I believe first-timers have gotten smashed between the side of the screen and the car, or the tree, or the stoplight. Who knew, who knew a box that displays TV shows would be so dangerous to video game characters' health? Here it comes. And, oh yeah, this is... You're just about almost done, so Here it comes. whatever you do, don't Here it die. Comes. Here it comes. Here it comes. Oh, shut up, Tim Allen. Oh, you wouldn't guess to Here do this, would ya? Uh-huh, uh-huh. I don't think anyone would guess to do that. And here comes Andy's car. We just uh, grab the star and fall in. Comes. And we win. Ow. Watch out. And guess what? <sighs> there is no music in the ending. Yeah. Let's fix that. <laughs>